Marissa, tears today in the trial of one of the men accused in connection with the murder of South Georgia teacher and former beauty queen Tara Grinstead. Bo Dukes charged with concealing Grinstead's death and lying to FBI agents. Today, the man who says Dukes confessed to him took the stand. And Fox 5's Caitlin Pratt joins us now live from Wilcox County with a look at today's testimony. Caitlin? Good evening, Tom. Uh, that's right. Uh, tears, emotion on the stand from that former Army buddy. Uh, that testimony was this morning. Uh, later this afternoon, within the last hour or so, uh, a tough lesson revealed on the stand by GBI agents who worked this case more than a decade ago. They say the number one thing they take away from all of this is containing the information that comes out right after someone's disappearance. Uh, do you recognize uh, the person in those photographs? Yes. And how's that? From the billboard. Tears during testimony in the Bo Dukes trial. John McCullough, a buddy from Army Basic Training, told the jury. Dukes opened up to him about what happened to Tara Grinstead. The alleged confession, he says, happening after a night of drinking and drugging back in 2006. In court, prosecutors played an interview recorded by the GBI special agent assigned to the case. I want to make sure I'm doing my part, you know, for the case because I want it to, I want it to be fixed, man. McCullough testifying Dukes told him that his friend, Ryan Duke, had accidentally killed Grinstead and needed his truck, a white Ford F-150, to transfer her body. Dukes, according to this military friend, agreed to help, bringing Grinstead to the family orchard to hide the crime. It takes 12, over 1,200 degrees to burn human bones. McCullough says he finally reached out to state investigators after calls to local law enforcement went unreturned. How do you know that? Unfortunately, he's my cousin. Family members telling the court Dukes had bragged about helping to dispose of human remains, but because he had a reputation for lying, that boast was not believed.